Hey, welcome back to the short. This is Starship Inspector, a game developed by Vitalis SCH, published by Vedanta Team. Starship Inspector is a space roguelike in which every choice you make matters. Save a galaxy, rescue your crew members, serve an evil empire, or help an ancient tribe. But costly have to make hard decisions and deal with consequences. Um, quickest way to explain what this game is all about, it's inspired by FTL. Let's just uh, put it that way, and that will become pretty darn clear soon enough. Um, it's a pretty young game, released 30th of June. Um, I've play tested this a tiny bit, uh, not enough though. Uh, but I mean, I wish I could have had more time to do this. But uh, apparently, a new update came out. I was asked if I could beta test this, so you know. As I'm doing these short series, this seems like an opportune time to play more. Um, quickly check the options. Uh, okay, cool. Alright, I'm going to do the tutorial because <clears throat> it's been a while. And it immediately gives you guys a little bit uh, of an insight on what this game is all about, isn't it? Okay, strange voice of a creature speaking from beyond the broken cry chamber door. Captain Kuh needs you, you get out, brush off your uniform. There's an insignia of tutorial Corvette Starship. Does that mean you are, yes, in a tutorial? Okay. <clears throat> um, parts of your brain, memory loss, sure. Uh, equip a PL core, which I believe is our quote unquote reactor in this game. Uh, energy from a resource known as Platon, which is our fuel, if I'm <clears throat> not mistaken. Uh, yeah. Carbide grader is known as something. Uh, system consumer energy is why after. Uh, yeah, so <clears throat> unlike an FTL, the moment you jump. Um, all this stuff gets depowered and starts charging from there. So you're basically setting duck when you jump somewhere. Uh, so that's cool. This is the control menu. Uh, turning off the charge speed of our system. Right, so the less power you use, the faster stuff charges. Um, Try to turn it off. Turn what off? Okay. Uh, right, my, I choose someone to interact with this guy because the tutorial said to pick the other one. Uh, left clicking to move, okay. Okay, these are neat. Uh, all of my have only problem with ship to try giving a quick order. Uh, could we fix the system yet they cannot restore it all itself? Right. <clears throat> Can I? Yeah. Ah, oh, right clicking works too, that's good. I'm used to right clicking, so. <clears throat> Where's this guy going? I didn't ask you to go anywhere. Oh, it's because this is on AI control now for some reason. <clears throat> uh, about to run off. This is oxygen though, isn't it? Status on. Open door to. Can you click doors too? Yeah. I've played enough FTL to know that. <clears throat> Cool tried to defend himself, system is not under any threat to crew maintains its working order. Oh, so you can man everything in this one. Alright. I thought I... There we go. Uh, system is maintained by a crew, system is being maintained by a crew, which functions will charge much quicker. So I should put somebody in weapons. What is this? 
Plus, oh, okay. So that's weapons. This is. Just probably have somebody in here. Why don't you go there? No, no, no. <clears throat> I think this is shields. Yes. Where are you? This is. Yeah, there we go. Come on. Chop, chop. And then we can save. Good. Uh, she's are down. She's protected from laser beam weapons that are threats. Okay. So I don't know if you can like put only one power in them or not. Uh, it also doesn't seem we have. Like a max power thing. <clears throat> so basically, what you could do, I think, is like when you jump, only turn on like weapons, shields, and uh, this thing, and then when those are charged, you can start powering up all the other stuff. Uh, current call, make your. Yeah, okay, continue. Okay, so these are also function as sensors. I think. Uh, occasional case you can jump to unavailable case with. Uh, So you can jump to any one of these, huh? Alright. <clears throat> uh. Okay, so the chain that's a lot of buttons. Go to your PLM between your weapons. Right, so this is a missile launcher, right? Uh, yeah, bullets per barrel. <laughs> Not sure what a barrel is supposed to mean, but... <clears throat> oh wait, is this not a missile launcher? I've always messed up with <clears throat> how these worked states off. Oh, because this isn't powered yet, I think. So let's turn that off for now. That off for now. <clears throat> we'll just have these. Eh, I don't think oxygen is overrated. Uh, we'll turn that off for now as well. So having done that, the other system should charge quicker. Uh, select a droid to turn it off. Let's carry it out from bottom to top. You just told me to. T <clears throat> Better right mouse. Oh, yeah, this is also. Whoa, it's still going though. Um. Right, so right click, and then you pick <clears throat> which weapon fires you. It will be more interesting if these were numbered, so I know which one of these they are, so when you have multiple ones of them. Because only one of them is actually ready to fire at this point. Okay, so this one should fire now, right? Yes. So, <clears throat> one of the things I did notice uh, when I was doing the beta thing well the first test on this was that you can't turn off weapons or at least not stop them from firing which is kind of weird cocktail bar 
What the hell is a cocktail bar? <clears throat> um, guess all of my stuff is charged. I can't see inside. <clears throat> uh, so I think now that that's done, eh, we'll wait until the other weapons are. Is this on? I don't know it is. Okay. Um, so I believe you can, in this game, target with a drone as well? No, not anymore, I guess. The heck? I can actually see how well they're doing as far as their shields. I don't know. We're doing good at missing, though. Takes us back to FTL, doesn't it? Um, okay. Uh, is your monitoring system to spend these three? Okay, so this is where the upgrading comes in. It's a little bit different than what we're used to, I think. I don't want to upgrade the med bay. Uh, let's upgrade the weapons. Do we have enough for that? Yeah, we do. <clears throat> I guess we have. Okay, yeah. We have to upgrade. Okay, fine. So what happens if you spend all your scrap on other stuff? Okay. Is it to be lucky like you bring your system or weapons that can upgrade your systems and improve their overall combat effectiveness? So you can upgrade your weapons too. Okay. Uh, flash a draw, you'll need a droid schematic and a weapon model. Droid schematics can be earned in battles or purchased at trade stations. Weapons are located in your ship's hold. Yep, there's a problem. <laughs> Don't uh, give us the option to. How did I get to that thing anyway? Oh, there you go. You can just do it that way. Okay. Uh, Grimmers and Cry Sleeper wake them up. <clears throat> Why would you not want them to be awake? Yay, I won! Why would you? I guess it's if you have more crew members. Like you're not, you can only have eight around, but you can have them in the hall, in the in the hall, I guess. Um, so there's like a ton of ships in the game. Oh, we actually start off with a few of them. Giant alien spiders, <clears throat> or I guess they're more like jellyfish. Oh, we can see what, uh, there's a bar, <clears throat> ion beam, unmountable. Okay. Um, let's just start with the basics. So we can't have control our ion beam. We 
If you have stealth, that's cool. Alright. Um, so yeah, we've got tiny ships, which is pretty cool. Uh, yeah. Just go with a basic model here. Uh, Stuck custom parameters, screen adventure, quality, and preference. Grandiose spades. How do I campaign free? Time limit, catch, stealth. <clears throat> Just gonna leave this as is, I guess. Um, let's go. It's nice that you can uh, tinker with a bunch of stuff. Quad is in danger, powerful towers. Practically enslaved, entire sector we recommend to ready as many gates as you reach as many gates. Some of the crew will be your ship and put an end to Taros tyranny. Okay, so what do we have? We have a uh, missile launched. I think this is a missile launcher, right? I do wish it would say when something's a missile launcher. I'm only assuming that this is a missile launcher because I believe it was a missile launcher before the um, well, when I played it. Um, temporarily opens airlocks to throw out any but in a compartment oh <clears throat> so you can like legitimately vent people in this game huh that's neat good for boarding be like boop and they're out not too many airlocks in the game though, just here and here though. <coughs> okay, um, let's jump, I guess. Return the med bay off. Make sure that these things power up a bit quicker. <coughs> Uh, data center defense mechanism is already disabled. Drones of weapons are deactivated. Return them in contact with the message your base that found. Obviously, you're on the maze of broken starships. Reminder of a terrible battle took place. Alright, we get some free stuff. You're not. Yeah, you're neutral. There's still stuff in there. What is that? <coughs> so there's like. <coughs> Beacons now that don't actually have anything in them. Last time I played this, it was all like, here's a fight, here's a fight, here's a fight, here's a fight. <laughs> Gates open, and the first thing you see is two starts fighting for the right to own mining station. They're too busy to notice you. Um... Pioneer cargo ships, Captain explained that they are being attacked by pirates and asked you to defend the mining station together. Wait, you can oh you can have multiple fights. That's a first. That's cool. Uh how do I Because that's my ship. That's cool and all. That's empty. That's the good guys. How do I go to the enemy view? There we go. Here we go. Seba makes total sense, right? Um, okay. Can I switch the order of these? No. So stuff is charging, but yet slowly. Only have one weapon. That's good. Right, so let's see if this is in fact a missile weapon. Can I use hotkeys? No, you have to right click the rooms, right? Um, okay, we've got 14 missiles, then now we have 13. Okay, so again, can we turn the weapon off now? What if I. No, reselecting it does not work. So I think this is still a. You can't stop a weapon from firing other than turning it completely off. Is that one of mine? Yeah. So, I take it that's quote unquote mind control. I think that's new too.
Okay, I should get rid of... Oh, you can just... Mm, my patrol is still active. Even though their ship is... That drone is causing some issues as well. Um, I'm hitting all the buttons, not... The, there we go. <clears throat> Apparently D got me here as well. Um, okay, let's try to take out the drone then. Um, is this their shield? Like a whole bunch of crud? Also, is the other guy actually doing anything? Did I shoot our drone? I don't... I'm not a huge fan of not being able to see what's going on on my own ship. I guess I can if I had the... Um... It's pretty hard for me to see what's actually going on now. Oh, you can hover over it and then hit one. It seems that's working. Oh, one of them died? Uh, well, let's restart then. I didn't even see him go down. There's too many weird noises. Um, So this should be randomized. Um, yeah, the map is looking different now. Cool. Uh, ships, they just drift in space with no signs of... Um, Well, that's a good thing I didn't go to any of these ones, then. Uh, let's see... I don't see any drones... Well, there's this guy. Is the game running? Yeah, okay, stuff is charging. Um, <clears throat> just give me this one for now. We'll target here. Okay, so yeah, you can hover over a tile and then hit the corresponding weapons button. Is the game running? Yeah. 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 Uh. So apparently you can just shoot straight through shields. So boarding is definitely an option. Hmm. 
Okay, so that's stuff on my ship that's on fire. How are they doing though? They got way more people than I do. So we're probably not going to be boarding on this one. Okay, I don't want one to fire anymore, but there's just nothing I can do about it, I think. I can just target other rooms with it. Which is a pretty interesting way to go about things. Ooh, I do like how this becomes like a crosshair thing. I thought somebody died again. Archives on board of the defeat ship revealed that the vessel was in standby mode. Last order was to destroy ships because they were infected with a coronavirus. High by organic life form that can diffuse through any surface and take control of a living organism, then endeavor cargo ship into power saving mode until you arrive. You guys are on AI. Don't think you should fix this. <clears throat> yeah, if it takes less time trying to fix a bloody breach, it wouldn't be a problem. Okay, so we're back to received one help. <laughs> one entire help. <clears throat> Aren't we pleased? Okay, so he's got the mind control again, so we need to keep an eye on our crew. It's kind of weird, it goes like, warning, 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 guys suffocating, but he's just getting pummeled to death. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's fine. Doink. Um the other thing isn't charged yet. Um, we got missiles, let's just keep firing a few more of them, I guess. Uh, it's not looking as it's intended, I would imagine. Um, yes, I want to fire weapon 2 here, thank you. Something seems wrong here. Okay, you turn off, we don't have that many missiles. Uh, weapons are... Completely destroyed, it's hard to tell. Can I go back to my own ship? Okay, so we can have a complete overview of things, which is nice. Um, I guess I should just get used to watching the whole fight in this screen. Otherwise, I'm never seeing what's going on. Um, uh, ship is not stopped force to be reckoned with. Eh, I would say that. 
Police keep fighting, so your enemies just give up. They plead guilty, ask for forgiveness, offering to repair your ship if you show mercy. Insult my crew like that? What do you mean? They didn't insult me. So did that actually repair my hull? I'll just take your word for it. Um, so I'm wondering... Nebula, okay. Uh, so I'm looking for trade stations. And apparently there's one over there. Of all the store ships, sure. So, what are we doing? <laughs> so, we can jump to the store right now if you want to. I kind of want to again, I don't like missile launchers, I don't think that's going to change in this game so. Let's just head for that store. Uh, can I invite you to dock at? Sure. Okay, how do I shop? Wait, are these mine? Okay, these are the ones I can buy. Upgrade your ship's hull to see more items for sale. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <coughs> I want to buy this one. I can't. Can I sell the missile launcher and get enough? I can. Is it wise to do? I don't know, but I'm going to do it anyway because I'm only using the missile sporadically and that's never a good sign. Uh, here you go. Now give me your quill gun. So, what's the difference? Oh, this has two shots to it, okay. Can we sell missiles and stuff? Yeah, you can. Can you tell I'm not a big fan of missiles? <laughs> Cube, a bishop's substance. Contains an ion energy. Oh, so we can upgrade like our weapons with ion. We need fuel. Nah. So what's the bar? A quiet place where you can rest. Okay. Right. Stores five items per type. Cool, what are these? Generates oxygen to compartment, can't move. Allows it to teleport into any adjacent compartment. Okay. Doubles the amount of damage you take. Oh, this is new. Okay, well. <clears throat> I think that's fine for now, and I think I'm actually going to end this episode here. Again, we're going to be doing a few episodes on this. I kind of want to see where it goes, and... Um, yeah. I hope you guys do as well, because this is interesting. 
Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode, though. So, uh, yeah, links to the game will be in the description. Uh, if you want to try it out for yourselves, by all means, do so. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.